Hi everyone, my name is Matt. Welcome to my shop. Today we're taking a look at a few of the work holding bench accessories from Veritas. So in front of me I have the hold down, the surface clamp, the bench dogs with the optional muzzle, the bench pups, the prairie dogs, the wonder dog, the wonder pup, and the surface vise. So first let's take a look at the standard round bench dogs and their various styles in a little more detail. The dogs are just your standard round bench dogs that fit into a three quarter inch hole in your bench top and the pups are just a shorter version of the dogs. These are just intended for a thinner workbench, anything two inches or less. Now optionally you can get a muzzle and this slips right onto the dog and it helps to protect your work and provide a really good gripping surface. The dogs are spring loaded so that when you put them down into the hole they'll stay at whatever position you set them at. The dogs can be stored beneath the surface of the bench when they're not in use. And when you need them, you just reach up underneath your bench and push up and the dogs will come right up out of the holes. On the prairie dogs, however, they actually pop up out of the holes. So if you don't have a through hole in your bench or you have a dog hole in an odd spot where you can't reach up underneath the bench to lift the dog up, the prairie dog is gonna be great for that. The dog just sits down in the hole and when you're ready to use it, you can just touch the top of it It'll pop up out of the hole, and then when you're done with it, just push it down again, and it'll hide beneath the surface until it's ready to be used again. The Wonder Dog and the Wonder Pup can be used in conjunction with the Bench Dogs to clamp things directly to the bench using their screw clamping rod. This is going to be particularly useful on benches that don't have a vise, or on a vise that doesn't have a dog hole in the jaw. The Wonder Pup is just a shorter version of the Wonder Dog for a thinner bench top. The Surface Vice is a more robust version of the Wonder Dog. It has two dog hole posts. The first one here is locking and the other one is a quick adjust screw mechanism. On the end, the face pad that actually pushes against the workpiece can be outfitted with your own custom jaws to make this thing a really versatile tool. So let's take a look at a few examples of work holding with these bench accessories. Probably the most common use of the round dog is going to be in a jaw of a vise and that's gonna allow you to move the dog back and forth and pinch workpieces between the dog in the vise and a dog in the bench to secure a workpiece and hold it for planing or chiseling or whatever you need to do to that workpiece. My bench happens to have a row of square dogs in it, but round dogs are easier to install and their heads can rotate to hold things at odd angles. So if you don't have a vise or you don't have a way to mount the dog in a vise, the Wonder Dog or the Wonder Pup is going to be a great solution for you because you can have the Wonder Dog or Pup work just like the vice action on the vice. So you can put the workpiece between the Wonder Dog or Pup up against a dog and tighten down the Wonder Dog and now you have a nice vice anywhere on your bench. If you position this thing so it's towards the outside here, you have a really easy access for the adjustment knob on the screw. But this can be positioned anywhere in the bench. So for whatever reason, if it was easier for you to clamp something out in the middle of the bench, you can do that too. The Wonder Dog or the Wonder Pup combined with a standard bench dog is going to be a great solution for clamping things anywhere on your bench where you need a lot of versatility in the location of where it's clamped. For instance, if you're doing a lot of carving and you want to be able to move that piece of wood that you're carving around quite a bit if you want to get it in different positions so it's more comfortable to carve on, this is going to be a great solution for that because you're able to put the workpiece exactly where you need it maybe close to the edge of the bench, flip it around really quickly if you're trying to keep going with the grain direction, for instance, and it's gonna work out really great. Since the Wonder Dog holds the workpiece from the side, another great opportunity for using this is when sanding. The heads on the Wonder Dog are 5 eighths of an inch thick, so if you're sanding something like a 3 quarter inch thick workpiece, you can hold that workpiece down to your bench as you're sanding it, and you don't have to worry about that workpiece running off on you as you're sanding. The Surface Vice is a more robust version of the Wonder Dog and Pup. So it has this quick release mechanism and it has a lot more travel. So it can fit down into two dog holes. The fixed posts can be locked down so the vise can't lift out of the bench. You can butt your stock up against a dog or a couple of dogs depending on your arrangement. You can also add a custom jaw to the Surface Vice if you're trying to clamp something at an odd angle and odd shape. I've made this angle block to clamp this board coming in at an angle just to demonstrate how that works. The screw post has a quick release, so to engage the screw, you just turn that post 
to engage the threads and then tighten down the rod. And this is really secure even though I'm clamping at this odd angle. Lastly, let's take a look at the surface clamp and the hold down. The surface clamp can be inserted into a three quarter inch dog hole. The top knob can be tightened to lock the surface clamp into the hole. The workpiece can be placed under the other side here. This thing actually turns all the way around so you can get to any angle you need. Drop it down on your workpiece and just turn this knob. And your workpiece is secure. So one thing to keep in mind is you're not limited to just using the accessories on the top of the bench. If you have dog holes in the side of your bench, you can use all these things here as well. So I have my sliding dead man with some dog holes in it. And if I wanted to clamp this board to the side of my bench, I can do that really easily. The hold down is really similar to a traditional hold fast, but unlike the traditional hold fast, you don't need a mallet to set the hold down in place. The hold down also has a barbed and ribbed shaft that's going to go down into the hole and really grab and bite that hole so it does not go anywhere. Simply put the hold down into the hole, spin the knob till it's tight, and then your workpiece isn't going to go anywhere. This is going to be great anytime you want to securely hold anything down to your workbench. In this case, I'm setting up to clean up some dovetails, but if you want to chop some mortises or hold down a jig, for instance, this is going to be a great solution for that. And when you're done, you just spin the knob and the hold down releases. The hold down can also be used in the leg of a bench to work in conjunction with a leg vise to hold a piece on edge for edge planing. Although I did show these bench accessories being used on my traditional workbench, these bench accessories can be used on non-traditional workbenches as well. The only thing you need to have are three quarter inch holes for any of these bench accessories to work in your workbench. So I hope you enjoyed taking a look at these Veritas bench accessories with me today and I hope you can see how they can make your time in the shop a little more enjoyable by making your work holding a little more convenient. So until next time, happy woodworking.